Hello guys, uh, welcome to my channel again. Um, today is the 27th of December 2020 and we are here at Tap Moon, which is a uh, secluded island here in Hong Kong. Uh, we all have a public holiday here in Hong Kong and it's also Sunday. So I thought maybe, you know, we should just uh, roam around. So I woke up this morning and uh, I did some research, brief research, and I concluded with this Tap Moon. It's, uh, it's located uh, in a uh, very southern part of Hong Kong. Now, how did I came here? I took ferry from um, Wong Sik Pier, which is a uh, 30 minutes ride from Sai Kung bus terminus. We took bus number 94. And uh, this place is very famous for fishing village as well. There are a lot of fishing villages in Hong Kong, but this place is not that famous because of the commercial uh, advertisement, etc. So that's it for now. Hello again. So uh, we are heading to a Tin Hao Temple, which is just located in front of the Takmu Pier. You can see there. Um, uh, this temple name is Tin Hao Temple. Uh, it's a very peaceful temple. You can see the dragon uh, statue on the top, and the various flags around the temple. And uh, let's see what's in there, because this is my first time as well. It looks very peaceful around here. Um, you can also burn uh, incense uh, stick around here. Uh, let's see if we're allowed to go in. Very peaceful around here. Can we enter? Yeah, we can enter. Um, very peaceful. The weather is very beautiful today. You can see it's sunny, it's 23 degrees, but it's very sunny. I want some nature around me. So it's a form of meditation for me. So I do come to places like this often. Hi, so after uh, you know, after reaching uh, the Grand Island, uh, you can do five minutes hike, and you will reach uh, um, in this majestic place where you can witness this beautiful sea, along with this uh, you know um, beautiful mountain where uh, you know it reminds you of Hanoi or you know Vietnam. Uh, it's really nice. You can also do camping so you can see people are actually building their camps. Um, and then now we're going to head towards the, the Balance Rock. Uh, we believe it's 10 minutes ahead of us. And uh, uh, the water is like one of the things that you know I really liked here in the Grass Island is that the water you can see is a very blue, like a uh, you know clean as uh, crystal clear, uh, which in the other part of Hong Kong you'll rarely see it's usually green in color but this is like you can see you can see sea all over this place with a beautiful scenery and uh, hello again you know while i was walking from the grassland towards the balance rock i realized something you know we are currently um, living in a world where the situation we can't control the pandemic is all around, all around the world and you know we're not able to travel around the world but you know that doesn't really uh, mean that you can't go you can't travel there are a lot of nature around you try you know today go to your uh, searching site and look for the uh, the nature the natural sites where you can go and travel you know it, that also brings you mental peace uh, so we you know we woke up in the morning the plan was very spontaneous and then we just you know uh, got into the boat and we got here in the other, another part of the island and now we've reached here at the balance rock very large opening you can see 
um, you know, there, there are lots of mountains around here and these rocks are quite balanced. You can see the shape of the balance. They're supporting each other and um, it looks very beautiful. Hello, here's Shiza and I back again. So we've actually found out the real uh, balance rock, which are down here by the sea. You can see, you can see that especially this thing is quite balanced. You know, it's not falling. It's been there for many years. And, uh, you know, look at all the structure of this rock. These are very unique. I've never seen such rocks in my life before. And it feels great to witness, you know, such uniqueness around here uh, where you've been living all your life and, you you know, you have not been to such places. It feels amazing. Um, and, you know, I am especially loving to sit down here because, you know, I'm scared to go down there and it's quite dangerous. So I'm enjoying here, I'm witnessing this beauty and then you know I'm reminiscing all the beautiful memories I had. Signing up. Hi, so now after you know uh, after visiting the Balance Rock, uh, we are heading towards a new fisherman's village. This is the extended part of the Balance Rock. You can see this tiny rock right here. Um, look at this beautiful um, the new fisherman village is very beauty, uh, be very beautiful. You know, these are made of metal, but um, um, you know, these they look like a log crocky, whatever that is called. But it's very beautiful. Look at the scenery. I am actually at this very point loving here to walk. Um, I could, you know, I could come here every day if it was not that far from where I live. Uh, it took me about one and a half hours to get here and uh, you know you have to take the ferry a ferry and the ferry are very the ferries are not uh, frequent you have to check the timetable before you head to tap moon uh, let's see what's there for now i'm signing up